Hi folks, John in Thailand. Oh, you know, you can hear car bomb in the background. He's just behind me. Um, just got my pickup back from the mechanic. He put a new head on it. And uh, yeah, I think he put new pistons in it, new rings and a few other things. Uh, it's, it's looking clean. <laughs> I think they cleaned the whole thing. And they gave me the gave me the old old head here which is that one supposed to be warped or something's wrong with it it's hard to know just there there's a little spot where it looks like there's a, a, a corrosion I think it's cast iron but I'm not 100% sure um, could be just normal iron who knows? Unless you're a professional mower mechanic, I guess you're not gonna not gonna really know. Uh, there are a few other things there. Uh, I'm not quite sure. I haven't checked in the box yet. But we got we got to just take it easy for a little while, maybe 500 kilometres, and change the oil again. Uh, yeah, and it was all due to the fact that the damn thing uh, had a hose. Uh, leak up here it's looks different I don't I don't see the hose on this one it might still be there uh, there's a hose down there but that's not the one that was the problem or maybe it was a bit hard to tell isn't it in the dark half light reason it's not so bright here is it's uh, the wet season and it's like pretty much 100% cloud cover at the moment uh, yeah so there's not much happening uh, on the pruning trees today. I got a got a few jobs out in the out in the shed down the back. Uh, a bit brighter out here. <laughs> uh, we got some Australian seeds planted. Uh, those ones are bell peppers. Don't seem to be growing all that well. We put a bit of fertilizer on them and some magnesium and sulfur, but they're still not real good. That one's starting to develop a couple of fruit there. Uh, yeah. And I think they were supposed to be beans or God only knows what in these other ones that Mrs. has planted. And here's some Australian tomatoes. Mm, because the Mrs. planted them, I've got no idea what the hell they are. Uh, they could be grossless or anything. I had grossless and mighty reds. But the seeds had already been open when I had a go at growing some tomatoes last year. So they're last year's seeds, but they should still be good. It's hot here most of the year. Um, things can grow any old time. So, yeah, a little bit of luck. We have got flowers. I'd just like to see some fruit. Uh, maybe that one's going to be my first tomato. Ooh, yeah, I can just see under there. The flower's gone, and it looks like a little fruit forming, which would be great. I'll tie him up. <laughs> we need some longer stakes. Um, these grow bags, I'm not really keen on. My wife planted them, so I think she just put seeds in them, and then uh, when the seeds come up, they just grew. Uh, that one there's a double leader. It's got two stems. You can see one, two there. Not so good idea, but we'll leave it now that it's grown up to be so big because both have got uh, flowers on them. Anyway, from a quiet day where, where I've got very little to do out here, but down the down in the shed I've got lots of jobs. Yesterday we set up a, a jig for making roof trusses for the greenhouse, which will be built in another small block of land where we have water and electricity. Uh, we call it the granny block. Um, anyway, that's it for today. Uh, I'll catch up with you again, and uh, you have a good day too. Bye now.